My objective in this video is to start publishing selected resources from a previous course I've taught or from a course I'm currently teaching that has materials in another section of Canvas into a course that I'm starting for the first time. So you can see that uh, I have a completely blank course um, that has been created for me. Um, but I actually have a really great uh, welcome module that I created in my last year's course. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to import materials uh, from a selected course into my new course. So I'm going to go into the settings menu and in my new course and on the right hand side I'll see import content into this course. I'm going to pull uh, content from another Canvas course that I've taught. I'm going to search for the course name. Uh, And there it is, Introduction to Canvas. I'm going to choose only specific content that I want to import, which is that welcome module. I can continue to import different modules or different resources um, anytime I want. But in this case, I'm just going to choose uh, one module for this example. And then I'm going to adjust the events because I have assignments um, that in that first module that I had students complete. Um, and so I need to think about uh, the beginning date of the module, uh, which started uh, last year in uh, 2014. So I'm going to go back to August 2014. And I remember that the first day of school was on the 25th. Um, I'm just going to go ahead and get rid of the time. And then I'm going to change it to this year, which starts on the 24th. Um, and I remember the module ended uh, on the 31st of last year, um, which was a Sunday, and this year it's going to end on a, uh, the 31st, which, I'm sorry, on the 30th, which is a Sunday. And by doing so, uh, it's going to adjust uh, the assignment dates uh, accordingly. Um, when I go ahead and select import, um, I'm going to be asked to select the uh, uh, content, you'll see down here that this is easy to miss, that I need to select the content that I want to import. When I do, I'll have all the materials that I published in my last course. Uh, so for example, uh, if I had a syllabus I wanted to bring over or particular quizzes, or uh, but in this case it's a module, and it's that welcome module from the day one. And I'm going to go ahead and select that content and it's going to take uh, just probably less, depending on how much materials, less than a minute for it to complete. And once it's completed, now I can go back to my home page of my course and I can see that I already have my first module created. Um, and I can continue to do so uh, accordingly. And eventually, um, I uh, uh, might choose to unpublish the module until I'm really ready for it to get started in the course.